What up guys, today I'm playing Hitman Absolution and once again I'm doing a complete walkthrough of this game for you guys. Today I'm playing Operation Sledgehammer and I'm finishing off this level uh, for you guys. In this walkthrough I'm playing Burn and Hope Fair. Once again I'm playing on hard, I'm doing suit only and I'm not killing anyone except for the targets uh, if there happens to be um, you know, a target during the mission throughout this uh, walkthrough. So once you get to this part guys what you want to do is just go through the door and you just want to head to the right um, over here and you just want to take cover behind the box right here and you want to wait until the guard walks past you and then you can just uh, keep moving. Alright, once he walks past you, you just want to walk over here, guys. And you just want to keep moving. Just go straight for the ladder. Uh, climb up it. And then you just want to walk across here. Uh, climb down right here. And once you climb down, you just want to hide uh, by the pipes right here. Because you see that guard right there. So you want to wait until he turns his back towards you before you move. Once he does that, just keep moving and you just want to come over here. And then you just want to chill right here, guys. Because right there you can see there's a guard to the left of me. So you have to wait until he turns around before you can move up. So that's what I'm doing. So once he turns around, just go to cover to cover. Walk over here, climb the ladder. Walk over here and then climb down. And then you just want to hide behind this box because a guard will walk over this way. So you have to wait until he walks towards you and then turns around. So that's why I'm um, waiting right here. So there's the guard that I was talking about once he walks towards you. He'll turn in the, in the other direction. Once he does that and walks off, you can just walk right behind him. And from here on out, you can just keep walking, guys. You should be fine. And just head straight for the door. There will be a guard in here, but you shouldn't have to worry about him. You can just w walk right behind him, open the door, and just walk out here. Now, when I got out here... I wasn't sure if that guy would see me walking up the stairs or not. And I'm not sure if that's just a cop or some kind of janitor. I don't know. But I decided to subdue him. And then there's a dumpster uh, straight across from me that you can put him in. So that's what I'm doing. And you just want to go up the stairs right here. Uh, go through the door. You're going to go up some more stairs. It's going to take you to the next part of this level. The last part. Uh, so I'm just going to skip ahead. So when you get to this part guys. You just want to walk over here. And you just want to wait until this guard turns around and then um, subdue him. Now you could wait and just keep walking behind him until he gets to that back room and then take him out. But I decided uh, to take him out right away. Uh, once you take him out, you can just drag him uh, to the back room over here because there's a, uh, a box you can put him in. And in this back room, there is a sniper rifle that you can pick up if you want to pick it up. So you just want to drag them back here and put them in the box. And then the next thing you want to do is just walk back into that room where you started off in. And you want to hide behind the pull table. And two guard are going to walk up here, so you just want to wait for them. So I'm going to skip ahead. 
there's the two guards. Now you have to wait until the guard that's in front of me walks back down the steps and then that second guard will walk back into this room and he'll walk past the uh, pool table and then that's when you can take him out. So you want to subdue him and then and then you just want to drag him into that back room and put him in that box um, as well. So once you put them in there guys you just want to go back into the room you started off in and walk down the stairs. And this next part is the hard part but hopefully this um, what I'm about to show you will help you out. So you just want to come up here guys and you want to see where these two guards are and if the guards over here when you walk over here you're in good shape if he's on the other end you have to wait until he walks over here and then walks away like he's doing now before you can move so now you just want to walk over here and from this point on if you don't see a guard straight in front of me over this thing you're going to jump over then you can just jump over it and if you do see a guard here uh, you're going to have to wait until he walks away to jump over it but anyways you just want to keep walking over here hide behind the table right here and throw a brick right in the middle right there to get uh, the guards attention and then once they walk over there you have to wait until that guy in front of me walks past you and then you just wanna uh, head straight for the door and then that's pretty much gonna do it for this video the next part you just have to shoot the target and uh, but that's again it's gonna do it for this video uh, again, thanks for watching and I'll check you guys out later.